Attention, all good boys and girls, gather around the kibble bowl of wisdom. For Yogi Sinsta, the canine critic extraordinaire, is here to unleash a tail-wagging review of Miller's Girl. Forget chasing your tail in circles. This human drama's got more twists than a Pomeranian chasing a runaway sausage. Cairo, our spunky puppy in training, gets entangled in the leash of Mr. Miller, her writing teacher. He's all floppy-eared charm and belly rub promises, like a doggy with a bottomless bone bag. But beware, this Miller's got a hidden bone. It is hidden. Hidden by choice. Emotional manipulation. Worse than a mailman with a thing for stealing squeaky toys. You get mail, nigga? Ha! He tries to mold Cairo's voice like putty, barking orders like, Fetch this metaphor. Dig up this plot twist. Your words are my chew toy to bury. You, you baby boomers are so demanding. The first half, I admit, had me snoozing in the sunbeams, bored as a pug at a poetry reading. But then, woof, Cairo sniffs out Miller's pup-pateering tricks, and it's a ferocious tug of war for self-discovery. She sheds his control like an itchy winter coat, howling defiance at his betrayal. You see betrayal in others, but not yourself. <laughs> I wanted to lick her schnauzer snout for standing up to that two-legged bone hoarder. This ain't all tail wags and squeaky toys, though. This movie's got more layers than an onion wearing a fur stole. Seriously, humans, we get it fashion. Call me old-fashioned. It made me ponder how my human use is precious as a bribe to squeeze me into that ridiculous pink tutu. But hey, if it means extra chin scratches, maybe a little tail wagging manipulation ain't so rough, right? He's just manipulating us, again. Manipulating us? How? Miller's Girl ain't a laugh riot, but it's a juicy bone for pups who like dramas with more twists than a palm chasing a ball of yarn. It won't have you rolling around in the mud, but it might make you tilt your head and ponder your own chasing after squirrels existence. I am who you say I am. And hey, at least there weren't any squirrels. Who needs those bushy-tailed nuisances when you can watch humans squabble over words? Go ahead, cowboy. You got mad squabbles, boy. For me, this movie mirrored our own lives, you see. We, like Cairo, sometimes get tangled in the leashes of others, be it humans, expectations, or even our anxieties. I'm an anxious mess. We bark for approval, wag for treats, and sometimes get buried under their demands. Sit. 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 Our unique voices muffled by their expectations. But just like Cairo, we gotta sniff out the manipulation, break free from those leashes, and reclaim our barks, howls, and stories. My story isn't your story. It's about finding our inner squirrel-chasing, hydrant-peeing freedom. Our authentic selves buried beneath layers of good boy and precious girl. Wow. Precious. That's the beauty of this movie, see? It reminds us that every good doggo has a story to tell. Tell us a story! Yeah. A tale woven with the threads of their own experiences, their own barks and whimpers. We don't need someone else molding our voices or chewing on our words. We gotta write our own narratives, dig up our own buried bones of creativity, and howl our hearts out for the world to hear. I can't hear you! And just like Cairo found her voice, I know you can too, good boys and girls. So go forth, sniff out the sunshine, chase your squirrels of inspiration, and bark your stories loud and proud. Remember, even the fluffiest Pomeranian can write an epic. It was an epic beating. No, it wasn't. Even the grumpiest bulldog can pen a heart-wrenching ballad. We all have a tale to tell, a paw print to leave on the world. And you know what? We, here at Yogi Sinsta, believe every wolf deserves to be heard. That's why we're not just about comfy shirts, hoodies, and squeaky toys. We're about survival. Though, let's be honest, they're positively essential. Every Yogi Sinsta purchase helps fuel Yogi's movie adventures his quest to sniff out the best barks and the deepest bones of cinematic wisdom. You're so wise. Your support lets me share my reviews, my tail wagging insights, and maybe, just maybe, inspire you to unleash your own inner paw scription. So, don't let your stories stay buried like a forgotten chew toy. You want a chew toy? We get you a chew toy, okay? Grab a stick, dig up your memories, and wag your tail out for the world to see. I'm blind. And, hey, if you happen to find yourself snuggled in a Yogi Sinsta hoodie hmm? while you craft your poetry, well, just know you're helping Yogi spread the word, one bark at a time. Remember, every tail wag counts, and together, we can write a whole paw-sum storybook of adventures. Adventure awaits. Now, if you'll excuse me, I have a bone-shaped pen named Forever Writer to sharpen.
in a pile of blank paupers, just begging to be filled with my tail wagging tails. And remember, wag your tail and bark along if you want to hear more movie reviews from Yogi, the canine critic extraordinaire. Until next time, keep your paws off the furniture and your noses pointed towards adventure. Woof out. Woof woof.